There's a known Commando Sombra area. You know, if I've been doing my job properly, you wouldn't be out here in the middle of nowhere looking for some broad who got pinched on my watch. That's what we tell ourselves, huh? It's all our fault. I'm serious. By the time they grabbed the girls, I was half cut. I ain't slipping, man. I'm slipped. I'm a bad joke. Max, we work for private security. For all ex-soldiers, ex-special forces, ex-cops, ex-good guys. We all have our reasons why we became ex. Maybe now we can put things right, okay? So that was it, was it? Say the magic word and be absolved of your sins. If only shit were that simple, I'd have done it years ago. Me, I'd been stuck in the past so long, I'd forgotten what year it was. Max, quit your daydreaming. This is it. It's over there. I'm gonna cut the engine. Light in. Don't go anywhere. some hopped-up gringo a long way from home, making trouble the only way I knew. As the weather worsened, I caught a glimpse of the rusted shells of previous lives that had been lived out here in this swampy shithole, and I wondered if I would end up the same way, or what would happen to that girl I was supposed to protect. I couldn't understand them, but I didn't have to. Cheap hoods are the same from here to Timbuktu. The slab of meat on the boat was clearly the boss. Serrano, they called him. And it seemed that our suspicions were correct. Fabiana was here, somewhere further ahead. I had to find her quickly and quietly if possible. Last thing I wanted was a party with these clowns. So far, I'd managed to keep a low profile, a bit out of character for a guy who's only comfortable with a bottle of whiskey or a gun in his hand. I kept moving toward the signs of life, rubbing them out as I went along. I'd seen enough to know that Fabiana was at least alive, if not exactly well. Her captors didn't look like they were quite the kind and gentle type. I had to find that room quickly. Oi, Dani, você tá aí? Você tem um cigarro?
would be happening on that video feed now. Just my own imminent cameo. find Fabiana sooner than later, if at all. show starring Sao Paulo's favorite housewife. Probably thought it would grease the wheels with the ransom money, but it only made me want to shove the cash down their throats. She was on the move. If they'd finally decided to kill her, I wasn't doing anything to persuade them otherwise. There she was, right in front of me. The drunk fool in me wanted to make a play. But I had just about enough sense to know that I'd end up with another dead girl in my arms if I did.
was in a cocaine factory, but I'd stick to the depressants. I open the door to the next circle of this low-rent hell. scout. Fabiana in a worrying amount of time, but at least I wasn't following a trail of her fingers. <laughs> Malaria tablets might have been more useful out there. Keep on going across the docks. There they were. I had the feeling I'd been running one step behind ever since I got to this country. Maybe a few years before that as well.
way. Straight ahead. Okay, okay, don't worry. Hang on. Boy, did I need to hang on. The whole operation was slipping out of our grip. I was an overconfident chump who'd gone into the jungle alone. Shit. More company! Idea. Hold on.
tourist office should get a load of this. Man, they know all about it. Shows a different campaign. The place was crawling. How many guys they got? How many poor kids want nice sneakers? It ain't hard to hire. They were on them again. See Fabian. Who's on Fonzo? Alright, alright. I'll get us a little closer. Who's in? Fonzo, just give me a second. We almost had her. Damn. I don't think we ever had much of a chance. No one told us they had an entire goddamn army. I don't think anybody knew. Crazy shit. Yeah. It's all crazy, pal. Non-stop insanity. Thought I left all this shit behind. Easy gig, you said. What a fool I was to get involved in this madness. <laughs> 